Hello, everyone. This is Mrs. Rodriguez, kindergarten Cabrillo teacher. I am going to do a video. This is a how to video for create your own insect. Okay, so you are going to need scissors, glue, crayons right behind me. And these pieces right here, do you remember seeing this? It went like this. So I've got a song to sing. The song says, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. Eyes and ten limbs are six. Head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. Sorry about that. So an insect has a head. It has a thorax. It has an abdomen. It's got antenna, two big eyes, and six limbs. Three on one side and three on the other side. Okay? So we have heads here. We've got uh, abdomens and we have some thorax. So what we did, what I did is I chose one of each, as you can see. You can choose a combination of any three or you can do three. So you could actually, since you have three heads, you can make three insects, three thoraxes, three abdomens. So I'm gonna show you the ones that I chose. So I chose this head, this thorax, and this abdomen. As you can see, I colored them with my crayons. And now I'm gonna glue them together. So if I want my if I want my insect to be moving forward, the face is going to be this way. Okay. Glue problem. I'm also stuck to my microphone. Okay. These videos don't usually have a hiccup along the way. Okay, here we go. Then we've got the thorax connected to the abdomen right there. Right? Now, I have something extra. I found this somewhere. So I, you might have extra somewhere. And I am going to make six legs. One, two, three, four, five, and six. I'm gonna turn over my person here. Now, if you don't have, I'm going to use the three legs on that side. You can make them shorter if you like. You can make them shorter. So I feel like my legs are a little too long. So I'm gonna make mine shorter. Well, if I curl them a little bit, they can be kind of fun. Oh, that one's not dry yet. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that there. Now, there's one more thing that I can do to this. Two more things. One is if you have a pipe cleaner, you can make antenna. But if you don't have a pipe cleaner, you can use construction paper like I did. And I'm going to use 
I'm going to make these fun, fun, fun antenna. Let's see how. Oh, 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 got excited there. Now, I'm going to grab a stapler really quickly. Microphone is on. I think I usually have all of my materials ready to go before I start my video, but then I forget something. I'm going to staple the head right, antenna right there. Okay. And I can fashion my antenna any which way I want to. Or I can make antenna with this extra construction paper. Now there's one more thing that I could actually do. If you happen to have wax paper, guess what? You could make some wings because some insects can fly, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now I'm having camera issues. Okay. Okay, and what I do is I crumble them up to make it look a little bit textured and fun. And then I glue it on right there. Now you can make more bugs or just keep the one. What do you think? Done. All right. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Bye-bye.